On behalf of the North London Community Center, two teenagers named Yetzan Gonzalez and Michael Hobbs voiced their opinion on Sun Struggles and also the out school math programs. The North London Community Center took upon themselves to bring together teens from local communities to develop more opportunities for youth to stay off the streets and to seek a better future. I think it's extremely important just because, so I know uh, that's what I tell my students all the time, you know, Little Village and North London aren't that, uh, there, there's not many differences, they're basically both sa the same, you know, we're both uh, low income communities and we're struggling through the same stuff. I guess you could say it's helping out the community because it's sending good messages, you know, to young people like me and stuff. Pastor Field states his concerns about what teens are missing and what could be done to change their lives. Youth are missing opportunities. You know, you look at the neighborhood and suburban community, they got options. Two active youths affiliated with At School Matters and Firehouse are interacting with youths to help them understand themselves. And so what we're doing is doing this curriculum called Fulfill the Dream helps the kids uh, to know to get to know themselves better, get to know their friends, and just basically who they hang out with. It's not really just about boarding up, you know, helping out and stuff, not about the money and none of that. It's actually trying to help you out, you know, for your own self, you know. Every summer they could come here, do something with their lives. Pastor Phil gave his last intake on what he believed we should do to help youth. Well, I've been in this neighborhood 20 years, and I think that what ways in which you work with young people to change their lives is you help them see them see their own lives in a brighter way. I think you should have caring adults who walk with them till they, till they die. This is Real Shy Youth, Ronald Reese speaking.